It's basically one second per floor. Per floor. That's cool. That makes sense. That's the evidence Earth is round. Yes. Dude. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of evidence. <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of evidence there. But So I, I like looking at buildings as I see the sunset line come up the side of the building. You need very good transparency of the atmosphere because mm -hmm. if it's hazy then the sun is diffuse there are certain buildings especially in lower manhattan that do that at sunset yes and at lower manhattan is very exposed to the sun exactly setting over new jersey which right. is a clean horizon a very clean horizon for that yeah so a couple more because the sunset and sunrise points changes daily everywhere in the world mm -hmm. there will always be a spot depending on how wide that variation is, mm -hmm. you can find a street where the sun sets or rises on that street, as I did for Manhattan. That's Manhattan Hinge. Manhattan Hinge. Yeah. You gotta find the day. People talk about high noon. What do they mean by that? Well, they mean that's when the sun is directly overhead. Yeah, that is not true for anyone in the continental United States, any time of day, any day of the year. No such thing as high noon. Well, at some point, the sun's got to be directly overhead. It's not. Really? It is only ever directly overhead between 23 and a half degrees south and 23 and a half degrees north. Oh, so you got to be close to the equator. Yes. So you can only get the sun coming straight over you if you're down at the very baddest part of the earth. Has Santa ever seen the sun directly overhead?